Uh, we're here at the Big Bass Bash on Kentucky Lake, and uh, we're going fishing. We're going to try to catch a big one. I'm just going to go out every hour, try to catch the biggest one we can and bring it back away and hopefully win some. The first stop of the season took us to Henry County in Paris, Tennessee, where hundreds of college anglers competed for two days on the famed Kentucky Lake. This Big Bass format event consisted of seven weigh-in sessions, paying out close to $30,000 in prizes and contingencies. As long as we catch a couple good fish and get some points, that would be amazing, especially this being a double points event. Um, you know, it's what we're trying to do, stay school year, stay competitive. Um, and Murray's been consistently up there. Ooh. She looked a lot bigger. I saw that bucket mouth open up and like, ooh. Come on. There we go. All right. Got him. Begging. Oh. Next up, Dalton Kelly, Murray State. How about a 553? 553, yes sir. Dalton Kelly from top ranked Murray State University brings in this fish weighing 5.53 pounds during the final session on day two. That largemouth bass earns Kelly the overall tournament victory, besting second place by less than one-tenth of a pound. After two days of competition on Kentucky Lake amongst this group of hundreds of elite college anglers, the top ten was separated by less than a pound overall. Uh, so we started out this morning throwing cane walkers and uh, choppos, and after we caught, I think we caught two short fish real quick this morning, my partner did, and we decided we're, we're just going to stay out here in top water all day. And that's what we've done. We end up catching two keepers doing it. Both of them come off the chopo. Following the 2020 Bass Pro Shops Big Bass Bash presented by Berkeley, here's a look at the standings in the Bass Pro Shops School of the Year presented by Abu Garcia at that time. Murray State maintains its hold of first place. Back-to-back -back School of the Year winner McKendree University lingers close behind in second, and the University of Montevallo is in third. <laughs> 